Right, can you remind us uh, what issue you're tackling here? Um, well, it was an issue about whether, um, well, having a very large student population in Chelmsford, um, but then that's probably not retained within the, the local area, um, and a lot of it's probably lost. And actually, one of the issues about a very high contentment is to do with demographics and the fact that it's um, kind of um, sh shifted towards people who have families and old, older people. And that perhaps some of the issues about um, things like lack of creativity, innovation, um, would be provided by retaining some of those students within the local area. So, how might you do that? What? Uh... Um, we had a lot of discussion. I'm not sure we actually. Can... <laughs> 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 we, we, we picked no. out certain things, but I'm not sure it, it, it's quite formulated into a strategy yet. Um, so. Um, talk through. Well, one idea was um, oh, no. whether we could uh, partner with the universities to actually ease people out of being students, um, but give them some sort of support within the local area. Um, that might be helped by um, doing a couple of preparatory things, like a net, uh, doing network mapping, um, to find out how people connect, and um, a who's who survey. Um, then, what else um, have we got? Uh, anybody else chip in whenever you feel, <laughs> feel like it? The, um, trying to promote um, Chelmsford to London businesses as an option that they, they could save a lot of money by moving out of London. I think we were also looking at how you sort of build memories in this. While they're in the university, they sort of build a fond memories of Chelmsford. And so even if they do move away for better jobs, they do eventually have that identity with Chelmsford and come back to it when they get older. Because it's obviously not, may not be a place for... 25 year olds, but they may return. Any, any particular social media or other tools that were useful? Yeah, well, um, what was um, an issue that's come out in Leicester is about um, providing people the opportunities to kind of foster, it might be embryonic ideas about business, um, and that could be provided through a community cafe or perhaps using the courthouse as a kind of a major kind of um, hub where you provide Wi Fi and support. I, I kind of um, build into Chelmsford the tradition around Marconi um, and using those technologies. Um, and you could back that up with um, social media, using Twitter and Facebook, um, perhaps having health checks so that um, the existing local organisations can um, access those networks and use them uh, constructively. Um, and we're also looking at how we could um, find the people who are actually using these things and build them up. So, they, yeah. so there are champions of social media within Chelmsford if we find them and include them in a dashboard. So if there may be lots of people doing different things in that city, but they're all spreading in different directions, so bring them all together so it gives you a bigger identity.